What's up guys and gals, welcome to What's New To Goo. I'm your host Chris Goo with Alpine and we're here to talk about what's new, like really new. So I spent the last couple weeks playing with Alpine's latest product, a portable outdoor Bluetooth speaker, and I gotta say, it's got some potential. So in this episode, I'm gonna break this thing down and share my experiences with you. Are you ready? Are you sure you're ready? Really? I don't think you're ready. Yeah, you are, let's do this. They're not ready. Now, hopefully by now you all know Alpine and their reputation in the car audio world. We've always been committed to creating that Alpine experience in the car. Great sound, easy to use head units, and generally bringing you the joy of music to your drives. Now, over the years, we've dabbled with some personal audio devices that allowed you to take that Alpine experience with you. This year, we're bringing in a brand new outdoor Bluetooth speaker that you can take with you on all of your adventures, so to speak. Here it is. It's called the Turn 1. Thank you, fun young people. So let's talk about the design a bit. The speaker has an interesting shape to it. A slight flare here on the edges, uh, opening up to the passive radiators on the side here. Those are there for added bass response. I like the silver trim. Um, it actually reminds me of our Halo screens and subwoofers. Uh, this logo is actually an Alpine Lifestyle logo, uh, which is pretty cool with the five stripes of excellence there. The entire body is actually wrapped in this weather-resistant mesh, which is a nice touch. Uh, the silicone feet on the bottom are slightly flexible, um, decoupling the speaker from whatever surface it happens to land on. Makes it sound a little bit better. We also have three buttons here on the top. The plus and minus are for volume and skipping, and there's a power button here in the middle. On the back, there's a USB charging port along with the auxiliary input. There's a silicone cover over those to keep the water out. Now, if you actually look carefully, there's also a speaker pairing button here on the right, which allows you to pair two of these together. Finally, we have this slick shoulder strap here, which, to be honest, has come in handy more times than you'd think. So in the box, we have some paperwork, and there's this logoed container. Um, let's see what's inside. It looks like uh, there's a user manual. Um, I see a charging cable and an aux cable, just in case you have a device that doesn't have Bluetooth. Now, I don't see an actual charging plug in here, but if you're like me, you probably have one or two or 12 extras lying around. Now, there are two models available. The standard AD SPK1, which is the speaker alone, and the Pro version, the AD SPK1 Pro, which comes with a bracket to mount the speaker to a Jeep roll bar. Yes, Jeepers, I'm talking to you. The bracket is actually quite burly. Uh, you got this steel plate here, along with a foam landing plate, basically, to protect the paint in your Jeep. Uh, there's a pair of Velcro straps, which allow you to attach the bracket to the roll bar. And then you have a pair of buckle straps used to attach the speaker. Let's get this thing turned on and paired. That's epic. So let's find it on my phone. Get this thing connected. Pretty simple. So this guy actually has NFC. So if you're an Android user with NFC, you just need to tap the phone against the speaker and you're actually paired. All right, let's get this thing to listen. We'll actually have an idea. Why don't we take this thing outside? It's an outdoor speaker, right? Let's go. All right, so after much gratuitous B-roll, we finally got this guy playing, and it seems like my guests are pretty happy with the tunes. Let's go over some quick specs. This guy runs up to 40 watts of power and adds some bass extension with two passive radiators. The 5.0 Bluetooth can transmit up to 33 feet, and at 80% volume, can run between seven and eight hours. Maybe those fun young people can party for seven to eight hours. I can't. Can it play white noise for seven to eight hours when I sleep? That's my kind of party. Last but not least, the speaker is IP67 rated, which means it can be submerged in water up to one meter for at least 30 minutes. 
It's not like you're gonna play this underwater, but you never know when waterproofing can come in handy. Did I get you? Yeah. <laughs> Let's wrap this up. So there's a quick look at the new Turn One Bluetooth speaker by Alpine. You can find it at one of our participating Alpine dealers, or you can buy it directly on our website, alpine-usa.com, under Lifestyle Gear. There you can also find some new Alpine merch, like this awesome Heritage tea we just started shipping. Anyways, thank you all for listening. If you haven't done it yet, please be sure to hit that subscribe button and like this video so you can see more content like this. Alpine to Goose signing off. Be sure to tune in next time for what's new.